Hello everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel Boomi World. Hope everyone is doing great. If you haven't watched my previous videos, please go and check it out now. So in this video, I'm going to discuss about what is the written document shape and how to configure written document shape on Boomi. So first we'll look into what is written document shape. So written document shape is used to return the documents to the calling source point. Okay. So written document shape should be placed at the end of the path. Here the source points are two types. Either it should be a parent process or main process and web service server application. Okay. Suppose as per your requirement you have implemented one process call shape and after that you want to implement some more logic. Okay. So in that case you want to get final output of the process call shape. Right. So you can use written document shape at the end of the process call shape so that the result final result of the process call shape will return to the main process and from there you can implement another logic suppose you are uh, dealing with some web service server application and you want to return final result to the client so at that time you can use written document shape so these are the two source points Okay, so now we look into how to configure written document shape on Boomi. So written document shape is one of the logical shape. So under logic category, you can find written document shape. So this is our previous process, right? So here I have implemented one process call shape. Okay, so after process call shape, I want to include some more logic here. So for that reason, I want final result of the process call shape right so for that reason i'm just dragging and dropping the written document shape so here you can find written document shape definition so the written document shape is placed at the end of the document path and returns the documents to the calling source point which is either the parent process or a web service client application okay so this is the definition of the written document shape so this is the display name this is not a mandatory field but if you want to know whether it is a success document or failure document once you got the result to the main process so it's better to display some name here so i'm giving success document okay i'm clicking on okay so instead of end and continue i'm connecting to return document shape i'm removing this end and continue shape and saving the process see see the success document path came after process call ship okay so this is the written document path so the final result of sub process or child process results will come to this path so based on your requirement you can implement other logics here so for time being i'm just placing the end and continue and saving the process so to check the results i am placing one message shape here and I'm constructing message as success document saving I'm attaching the start shape to message shape and message shape to return document shape and saving the process save and I'm testing to see the result okay business rule got rejected so that's why it went to the rejected path so i just changed address details to india to meet the business rule condition so that it will go to the accepted path right yeah so i'm testing the process now so it is coming to accepted path because the condition got satisfied and you can see the final result of sub process here so the final result of sub process is success document right because we placed one message shape to populate success document so, so the same result got populated at the end of the main process yeah yeah this is how you need to configure written document shape on boomi yeah that's it about today's video if you like my video please like share and subscribe to our youtube channel and please don't forget to click the bell icon so that you will get all notifications whenever I post the video. Thank you all. See you in my next video. Until then, bye-bye.